keeping life in a good-natured perspective is a common practice of pilots. Come on. Come on. Rancher Albert Kolk will tell you that, especially after the flying adventure he, his grandson Jordan, and two friends endured on a night flight back from Seattle, crossing the rugged Manashee Mountains in British Columbia. It was a beautiful night. We were, uh, as we climbed to 9,500 feet, uh, we could see a starlit sky and we could see the peaks below us, the snowy peaks, and uh, down lower there was some dark green, of course, of the trees and some light grays. You could distinguish that. You could distinguish the odd river and some water below, but that's about all. There was no moon, but a uh, very bright, clear night. So everything was going well until uh, something went wrong. And then he said shoot and I remembered and all of a sudden just like everything kind of put it in perspective a bit. It was a lot nicer. You, you, you realize that you do have some security, some safety in that? I hollered, shoot, seat belts, and I pulled back the power, turned off the ignition and whatever needed to be done. Then I pulled the shoot. There was a little explosion, which was good to hear. It's kind of loud, but it's good to hear that explosion. But what was even better to hear, when that parachute started to deploy. And when, when it first starts to deploy, there's that ring above that that holds it for a ways, and then it starts to deploy more and more. And that's just such a gorgeous feeling. <sighs> it is holding, and we're going down on the chute, the whole pair airplane. And that was just a, such a beautiful feeling, a feeling of comfort and comfort and joy, you might say. Albert's airplane eventually floated safely to the ground, threading the needle on his way down through a small opening between some tall trees and coming to rest on a steep, sloped rock pile. We got a great landing. The, the parachute hooked a tree and it brought us around really slowly and set us down on, it was a fairly steep incline, but it was set us down in a really nice place. There was no trees, there was trees on both sides of us, but not where we landed. It was almost the perfect landing spot. And you all walked away. Yeah, everybody got out of the plane and walked away without a bruise, without a scratch, without anything. What is your life worth? What is the life of your loved ones worth? The ones you carry, whether it's your grandson or granddaughter or child or Girlfriend or wife, what's that life worth? Can you count that in dollars and cents? No way. Pull a shoot, you walk away.